Hello everyone, I'm the Nerdy Fool, and welcome back to more Zelda Breath of the Wild. Uh, I've been trying to think of what I want to do for this session. Last time we got here, talked to Robbie, but in getting here, we kind of avoided the tower. Maybe there? We avoided the tower, and so this area is unexplored. I kind of want to get this area explored. We heard of something to the west of the stable. I don't remember what it was. Maybe another shrine? But I kind of want to figure that out. But I think the main goal for this session is going to be dealing with the Vamado Divine Beast. That's my plan. We'll see how it plays out. But I guess first, I do want to figure out uh, yeah. I want to get this map sorted out. I remember seeing the tower somewhere and thinking it looked really dangerous and so avoiding it. But I should just take care of it. I'm assuming that's not the map for this area. That is the map for this area. Neat. Or not map, tower. I can talk. So what is red? Red would be in this direction. Is that just a shrine? That is a lot of guardians. Just trying to get an idea of where we I left off things. Yeah, red is that, which I assume is in fact a shrine. Oh, hey guys. Uh, not the torch. <laughs> Wind cleaver. Take you out. Take you out. Come on. There. That should be all of you guys down. Don't need any more bows. Okay. So, yes. If we're going down to the tower here, we'll start by just traveling to this shrine. I think there was probably a good reason why I skipped the tower. I remember being scared of it. But this tower... The latest tower that I dealt with, the one by the Vamado Divine Beast, that one also looks scary, but actually wasn't. It just had a lot of the corruption stuff around it, so I assumed it would be problematic, but it was fine. And there were a couple of guardians that I had to sneak past, the flying kind, but overall it was fine. Let's see. The tower is up there. And I see anything worrying. We've got an obvious path to climb up that way. Or I can just stay up here, maybe. I'm just waiting to spot whatever it was that scared me before. <laughs> Which is not a thing that I enjoy. Oh, thunder. Well, I guess lightning. It's probably going to affect my equipment. Okay. Did I already climb this tree before? I was here last. Maybe. Looks like it would have been a Korok location, but it's not, and there's no Korok there, so I guess not. Oh, yep, there we go. Let's... Nope. 
do what I want, not what I tell you. It's been a bit since I last played. So, not drop link. Uh, remove. <laughs> and no, no, no. No. Misclicking. Remove. There. Now I shouldn't be getting shocked anymore. Free honey. Always good. Alright. So our tower... Whoa! Is that the tower I'm heading to? It can't be. Ow? Are you serious? <laughs> Come on. Need something that gives a little bit of health. I'm not, not going to miss losing the ability for later. Eh, you'll be fine. Being shot at. <laughs> Oh, and it's raining, so I can't climb. Come on, Link. Yes, barely. Okay. So that is the tower I'm trying to get to. Kind of went in a roundabout direction, but it meant not going all the way down and then climbing up the narrow path that probably was full of traps. Or something. And I'm hoping Twitch will behave better today. So let me know if you see anything, if it's dropping or whatever. I don't think the problem was on the internet on my side, but who knows? I am hopefully getting new internet soon. <laughs> Are you okay? What's the matter? Come and get me. Oh, okay. Okay. That looked like it hit me, but luckily did not. So I think it's just up here somewhere, somehow. There's probably a sensible way to get up that's not scaling this whole cliff. That's the path that would have taken us up here. Something shiny over here. Amaranth. What is that over there? I'm just gonna avoid. <laughs> yeah, that's gonna be our tower. Okay, this looks like it was a park of some sort at some point. Bunch of dead guardians. Alright. Which hopefully means there won't be alive guardians, but historically... There often are. Rusty Halberd, don't care. And yes, I need a lot more 
guardian parts so that I can get that epic armor that Robbie had. Okay, there's a shrine somewhere. Okay. Please, no. So my thought is that if I get up here, I can get to this broken bridge and probably have some path of crossing over to the other side to get over there. Maybe. Someone said, I'll take you down. Took you down pretty quick. Soldier's shield. Not that impressive. Yeah, it's all of these flying guardians, which is why I avoided here in the first place. Nothing to search. Doesn't seem to be. Trying to get more loot. Alright, what's your story? Do you know the story behind that castle there? Oh, That's the Akala Citadel ruins. Long ago, at the peak of Hyrule's power, they built a fortress to protect Akala. It was said to be unassailable, but during the Great Calamity, Hyrule Castle fell. The army had no royalty to lead them. With no other choice, they fell back to the Citadel to make their last stand. Sadly, a concentrated assault from the out-of-control guardians spelled the end for this fortress, too. In real sense, the Kingdom of Hyrule met its doom here. Yeah. I found out my own kin died in that battle, so I came to at, last, to at least pray at the spot where they fell. But it turns out that the old guardians are still active, so this is as far as I go. I've never heard of anyone else escaping a guardian's sights, at least. You don't look reckless enough to chance it, but be on your guard in these hills all the same. Hey, Jorenda. Well, that sounds like an excellent reason to toss down a save. And then try and sneak through while the Guardian's back is turned. I shouldn't be climbing in the rain. What am I doing? <laughs> I should have done this after the rain. I am smart. Also, I'm just back here at the bottom again. Which is partially due to the rain, I'm sure. But alright, let's put on my climber's headband and my climber's tunic. For when I do try and do this climb. Hopefully the rain will stop soon. It's one mechanic I don't really enjoy this game is being stopped by the weather, which takes a reasonable amount of time to go away, and I just can't do the thing I'm trying to do. It's like, I want to just play the game, I don't want to just stand around waiting for the game to allow me to progress. But oh well. There we go. Sounds like the rain has stopped. But I think I have to wait for Link to stop dripping. There we go. Let's see if we can get up here and hopefully not be spotted by those guardian flying guys. That I'm sure have a name. Besides just flying guardians. <laughs> Okay, so what's the plan now? Of 
probably need to learn this guy's pattern. Okay, he's kind of just looking all over that central path. And then he goes back to the staircase. So I'll need to get up there while he's not watching the staircase. Oh, dear. Are we staying out of where he was? So apparently he does see things outside of his actual sight range, which is tedious. Have you forgotten about me? Yes. Okay. That's good, at least. Okay, so he spends a while down there at this point. I'm going to wait for him to come back. Let's we'll check out the stairs for a while. And it doesn't take stamina to hold on to the wall, thankfully. When it goes back to looking down there. And I'm going to rush up here. No, no, no. No, no, no. <laughs> no, no, no. <laughs> All right. Success. Just run quickly and hope to get out of its line of sight. You have a lot of health. No, I don't need that either. Okay, we've got another one of these guys. I'm just gonna climb the wall. <laughs> They're watching the paths too closely. Is this even where the tower is? Or was the tower... I'm thinking the tower wasn't, like, in this fortress. Or somewhere else, I thought. Okay, we've got a bunch of rocks here and a metal door. Was the shrine in here? Not sure. Okay, we've got one up there, top left-ish, that's probably going to become a problem. Hoping I can find a spot to briefly stand to get my stamina back. Or not. Might just make it all the way to the top. Yeah, there's our tower, but I think it's not in this fortress. It's on the next hill over. No, never mind. It's right there. Took off my bow and shield because of the lightning. Let's deal with that quickly. Okay, obviously that 
dropped that for the purpose of me using it as a bridge. Still wish you could turn things. Like, they gave me extra controls, so there's no reason they couldn't give me a control to turn this stuff. It would make placing things far easier. Whatever, that works. Call the tower. Don't see another eyeball to shoot, so probably need to grab this, use it as a bridge again. Get up here. No, stop turning. That didn't work. There ish. What is in there? Okay. Not awesome. Alright. I could just jump on here and climb. I don't see a good way of getting around. Man, that's going to use all of my arrows. Wow, Link. Such a bad jump. Let's just get over here and deal with this guy. Up close and personal. Alright. Dealt with him. Oh, it's cold now. Okay, well I don't need the climbing headband at the moment. I'm looking around to see if there's any other ways to clear up more of the tower. Ow, ow. Okay, let's... Quickly remove our shield. I think my sword just broke. So that's not a problem. Okay. You can now get up here. Rusty Halberd. Don't really need you. Oh, he's going to get shocked. Ow. I don't didn't think that the weapon I had was metal, so I didn't think it would have uh, attracted electricity. I need a new weapon. Sure. Don't need that shield. Alright, well that's one nice thing about the Guardian stuff, is I don't think the Guardian stuff... ...causes problems with electricity. Alright. This looks like where it would expect me to jump over to the tower. But there's still too much of this... ...goop. So did I miss a spot where I could shoot one of the eyeball things? Hmm. 
maybe not seeing it. Basically, I clearly need to get higher. Or I need to clear out the goop. Somehow. Well, there was an enemy in this tower that I haven't explored yet. It occurs to me I should not have tried climbing this wall in... the rain. Alright. You're dealt with. Rusty broadsword and shield. But no, that didn't show me an eyeball that I'd missed. So what am I missing? So I could hop on the tower, sort of there centrally. But I can't really get up, there's too much of this goop in the way. Again, rain is just annoying in this game because of the harm it makes to climbing. Because I don't really want to just stand around and wait. Whoa. Did not mean to fall down here. Okay. chest I missed. That's nice. Silver rupees. I will take. Ah, this is where we knocked off that bar by shooting the previous eyeball. I'm not seeing another eyeball to hit. climb, but what does that get me? Nothing. Yeah, I think I'm missing something obvious. Climb up to the top of this. Nope. Come on. <laughs> Just climb up the side. Don't try and go upside down. Perfect. So I can get here. Yeah. And possibly just barely avoid the rest. Not sure if that's the intended path. I think it'll work. Okay.
probably not as critical for me to stop on each of these levels anymore, because I've got quite a lot more stamina than I did at the beginning of the game. Don't know. But yes, this was definitely a scarier tower because of the guardians, because of the corruption. But yeah, overall, definitely doable. Barely. All right. Chica Tower activated. Scanning area. Hey, mostly Mento. Welcome back. Regional map extracted. Okay. So what can we see up here? Yeah, there's definitely something in there. Quarry. This shrine location is in a lake shaped like a skull called Skull Lake. Yeah, that's filling me with warm, fuzzy feelings. Rock woods. Okay, if we go to our quests. No, neither of those. Someone mentioned something. Bane and bone. Yeah, bang and bone. I want to say, and I could be wrong, but I want to say while we were at the stables up here, someone mentioned something to the west of the stables that I have a vague memory of, this sounds interesting, we should check it out, but I wanted to wait until I got the tower. But I don't see it in my quests. So hopefully I can figure it out when we go back to the stable, and if not, then we'll just move on back to taking on Vomito. Ignore all the random detours. Good evening. Need info about Kilton? Sure. There are a few reports of people spotting Kilton at Skull Lake, but I wonder why he only appears at night. Unfortunately, I can't leave this spot. I'm on guard duty after all. We're waiting to see a close-up picture of him. Okay, Skull Lake is the one we just talked about that has the shrine. Oh, no, it was you! Picongo! You said that the picture I was looking for was west of here. Hey, we meet again! Are you out traveling as well? I've traveled all over the world, so I'm happy to tell you what about new places if you want. You have a picture to show me? Let's see already. Which picture was it? Yeah. Hmm, I know. I've seen that spring and that goddess statue before. There's a place like this at the ruins in North Akala Va Valley, to the west of here. It's pretty much directly west of here. I'm certain you'll be able to find it without any trouble. That's what it was. Okay, good. 
So directly west is kind of this way. Ruins. Yeah, I think it is going to be here. That looks the most like ruins. We'll put green there. All right. Let's see if we can get to those ruins and hopefully unlock another memory. I'm glad they put Picongo in this game to help us with these memories because just happening, hoping to just stumble across these locations would not happen. It's too big of an area, too big of a game. I mean, I'm not going to say the game is too big. They did a great job, but the chances of stumbling across all of these locations without someone to help point in the right direction would be less likely. <laughs> Sorry, horse. Alright. Looks like we're basically there. Hoping they're in this crater and not up that mountain. Yeah. That looks like I'm right. You have done well to find this spring. Offer Dinral Scale received from this Dinral Scale received from the Red Spirit to the Spring of Power. I Goddess Hylia will guide you. I don't know what that's talking about at all. Dinral Scale from the Red Spirit. I'll figure it out. In the meantime, let's do some recall. seeking help regarding this power that has been handed down over time prayer will awaken my power to seal Ganon away or so I've been told all my life and yet grandmother heard them the voices from the spirit realm and mother said her own power would develop within me but I don't hear or feel anything Father has told me time and time again. He always says, quit wasting your time playing at being a scholar. Curse you. I've spent every day of my life dedicated to praying. I've pleaded to the spirits tied to the ancient gods. And still the holy powers have proven deaf to my devotion. Please just tell me. What is it? What's wrong with me? <laughs> That's a sad memory. You see Zelda struggling with being... feeling like she's not good enough for the role she was born to do, I guess. Somehow, what she's expecting isn't working. Oh, we've got three of those guys right there. Fun. Fun, fun. 